Evening all, welcome back to another beer review. And this one, I picked this beer up in Asda, um, in, in Harrogate, Harrogate, shall I say, very posh. Um, never had it before, it's a vocation, it's a double dry hopped IPA. I'm not a fan of tropical type beers, to be honest with you. So, hopefully I like it. And it's a can of their two con two can tropic. Two can tropic. I think that's the way you say six point seven percent ABV. Um, nice label, I have to say, it does look pretty good. Um, obviously nicked the two can idea from the toucan, two can, two toucan idea from old Guinness adverts, most probably knowing them. Um, so what does it say? It says a punchy fruit flavour and heavy hop aroma. Toucan, 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 toucans, toucan, play that, toucan play that game. This tropical double dry hopped IPA is brewed with twice as many hops for twice the flavour, creating bold and intensely juicy character. We've got HBC 586. Of course it has. I knew that anyway. Simcoe and Galaxy. <laughs> Your beer, our vocation. What do I think of vocation? Well, I was in a supermarket. They had a limited amount of beer there. And to be honest, the brewery, or brewery the breweries, should I say, that I do look out for in supermarkets is Vocation and Northern Monk. You can guarantee they're more or less bang on. There'll be the odd, you know, there'll be the odd grumble. Well, I have. I've had a couple of dodgy ones from both breweries, to be honest, but um, familiarity is the key, I suppose, when you go looking for beer in supermarkets. So, um, best thing to do, I'm going to just pour it. I apologise for that. Nah, she's kicking off. I can't be bothered with you. I can't be bothered with you. I'm going to let you out through that door. What's going to happen? You're going to meow on the other side of the door. I've already groomed you. I've already fed you. So I imagine now what you should do is what every cat does and go to bloody sleep. Or maybe should I just play you some of my reviews? Then you can go to sleep. Anyway talking to you now talking to the cat not you don't go to sleep in my reviews you can if you want but <laughs> as long as you press the like button <laughs> beer, in a, beer in a glass yeah it's hazy but it's kind of like like a light haze it's like a chalky limestone type of haze let's get the aroma Yeah, you can pick up tropicalness, but also in in the smell, in the aroma, I can pick up thinness as well. It smells thin. That's the first, it smells thin. It just does, it, it just, you can smell the thinness. But I could be proved wrong. I'm going to go in, cheers. Six point seven. You do get a hint of tropical that's there. But for me, and the way I smell it, the flavour of that tropicalness feels like it's on top of the beer. And when you start to drink it, it falls thin. It falls thin. Then you get a slight alcohol burn as you drink it. Um, mouthfeel. Mm. 
I mean, it's not the greatest mouthfeel, it's smooth ish. But when I swallow it, by the time I'm swallowing it, it feels thin and you pick up the alcohol. It does feel ordinary. It does feel like a beer I wouldn't go back to. Tropical beers are not my forte. I appreciate what they are. Um, I'll be honest with you, when I first had uh, Club Tropicana, I thought it was a great beer. I did, I thought that was that was one of the better ones. Um, but for me, this is watery. And it is the prime example why I've stopped venturing to supermarkets as much as what I used to regarding beers because there's always a pattern and I've said it time and time again there's always seems to be a pattern of the quality of beers in supermarkets you will find two exceptional ones then you get some which are middle of the road which I say this falls into to be honest middle of the road then you get some real bloody shockers um so overall, what you know, hang on, I'll just let her out. So overall, I mean, give it a go if you want. I think it was three quid a can. Um, it, it's not one I would go to. It just isn't. Um, it's just one of them. One of them. It's just one of them. Two can Tropic. Or two can or two can. Um, we've only got one two can on there, so it's two can tropic, I suppose. Uh, for vacation, um, give it a go if you've had it. Tell me what you think. Me, it just feels a little ordinary, in fact, very ordinary. Thank you very much for watching this one. It's always a pleasure. See you all again soon on another beer review. So, in the meantime, it's a big beep beep for me. Cheers.